Today I'm going to teach you an easy way how to motion blur an image. Now you see I have this beautiful picture of a Lamborghini here. I will link the image down below. And you can see I have a background layer here and the Lamborghini layer on top. Now I want to get rid of this boundary here that this layer came with so our motion blur is not restricted by these boundaries. So how I'm going to do that is I'm going to make sure this Lamborghini layer is selected. Go down to new layer click OK and then I'm going to right click this layer and merge down. Now to make sure that our motion blur does not affect the original image we are going to duplicate this layer. So I'm going to right click go up to duplicate layer and we are going to motion blur the image below this original Lamborghini layer. So we're going to click the one below it and go up to Filters, Blur, down to Motion Blur. And this is really nice because it gives us a preview of how this blur is going to look. Now I have Linear selected, and these numbers will probably be different for you. I believe they start here, or no, d that doesn't start there. This angle starts here, and it's making the motion go forward, and we don't want that. We want it to go back to make it look like this car is speeding forward. So I'm going to change the angle back this way. As you can see, it, it kind of rotates it as you're going back. And you want to make it go back like that. See up here, it's like going up. You don't want that. You want it to go back. That looks pretty good. And then the length we want to turn down just a little bit. We don't want too much of a motion blur. Now let's click OK and see how this looks. And it looks like this lines up pretty well with the back wheel. You could add more of a length to this, which I will do right now. I just hit Command Z on my uh, Mac computer. Go back to Blur, Motion Blur, and I'm going to lengthen this just a tad. Click OK. And I think that looks a lot better. So this is an easy way to create motion blur. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Like, comment, and subscribe for more. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Thanks for watching.